Hello, today I'm going to show you how to set up a fuel terminal on Tecalumet's HD Manager 8. First you want to navigate to Master Data on the top bar, then select HDA. You should see a page that looks like this. You can see we're on the Fuel Terminal tab. The other tabs we'll discuss at later videos. Step 1 is to choose an identifier. This is the name that you want it to be known as. In my case, since I'm adding a Wonder Box, I'll choose WB1. Then you want to select what communication method. In my case, I'll be using a USB flash drive, but if you were going to be using Wi-Fi or LAN, you would select this unit. Select the pin. Default pin is five nines. This is the pin that gets you into the master menu in the back of the Wonder Box. Go ahead and click Save. You can see here my fuel terminal has been saved at the bottom. The process is exact same if you want to do a super box. Change the identifier, change the type of, a, of device, and press save. If you were going to use LAN, you can see here it requires the IP address that it's going to be set up at. And you also have additional options. So on your right hand side, these options are your query options. This is the information that the Wonderbox or Superbox will require each time a user decides to use it. So for example, will it require just the vehicle number or vehicle and driver? Or will it also require an order number and the mileage? All depending on which specific settings you want, you can set that here. For USB versions, you do have to set that at the box. I hope this was helpful.